With St. Paddy's Day right around the corner, let's go inside to Finn McCool's a traditional Irish pub to see how they're going to celebrate. Come on inside. It's a St. Patrick's Day tradition to wear green, dress up and go out. This year, St. Patrick's Day is Monday, March 17th. So here at Finn McCool's, we'll be doing a weekend long celebration. On Monday, March 17th, we'll be bringing in Irish dancers and we'll have live bands throughout the weekend. We'll be giving out lots of giveaways as well as a trip to two to Vegas. For every pint of Guinness, Harper Erdinger you buy, you get a ballot to win the trip for two. And on Monday, March 17th at 10 o'clock, we will draw the winner. Among many traditions that will be celebrated this weekend, of course, comes the very popular Irish beer, Guinness. And here's a couple fun facts about Guinness. There is a 9,000 year lease on the Guinness Brewery in St. James Gate, Dublin, and it was signed in 1759. And also, 850 million liters of Guinness are sold annually. Did you also know that it takes three steps to pour that perfect pint? Ali shows us how to pour the perfect Guinness. So the perfect Guinness pour takes 119.5 seconds. When pouring a Guinness, you want to pour it on an angle, and you don't want to fill the glass up right away. You want to fill it just below the harp or in between. And then you want to let the Guinness sit so you can see it cascading. Then you want to top it off. Many people when pouring a Guinness do a little clover on top, but the perfect pour <laughs> is just like that. Well, wherever this weekend of celebrations take you, make sure that you do plan for a designated drive home or call a taxi. For Alton Insider, I'm Jennifer Nikolevsky.